Howdy folks and welcome back. We're gonna go to the fighting club. Because I have... Uh, I am impulsive to help people collect... Uh, helping out uh, round out their collection. There you go. Yeah, not a problem. <gasps> oh? Oh my gosh, you shouldn't have. I definitely wasn't doing this just so that I can get some exciting gift from you. Absolutely! Look at that Pikachu! Look how chonky it is! Look at that background. Everything about this card is nice. I mean, it's also just a decent card. It's not bad. Not a problem, dude. Thank you for the Pikachu. Alright, speaking of uh, giving people Pokemon, hey! Alright. Stop trying to push your books on me. Gosh. Taking care of plants is hard work. Let me rest for a while. Who, the master of the grass club? You mean Nikki? Nikki's out. I need a break. Do you want to play the Pokemon training card game with me? Okay, so this is more of a gardening club that also happens to play the Pokemon card game, it feels like. And I like that. Also, Brittany, what a perfect deck name. Etc. I don't need to explain to you what I have. It's just etc. I like it. May as well just say that you have the miscellany deck. <laughs> Alright, starting off with a seal. Not a great start, but that's okay. Ooh, she's starting out with five Pokemon. Look at her. She's ready. Alright. We might be battling twice. Oh, but she started out with a Magmar, so that's not great on her part. Oh, and she had the Charmander? Ooh, Brittany. Brittany, Brittany, Brittany. You didn't do your homework. Alright, let's get that water energy right now. Put it on. Let's see, there's no need to remove energies right now. We can just headbutt. We'll take this slow and steady if we need to. I have to say, I really do want to use a deck diff uh, other than this Rain Dance deck, but without grinding, you really don't have that type of uh, freedom to uh, investigate other deck types. Um, so I don't know. I might, I might do some grinding just so that I can show off some other decks, but. Um, I don't know, I don't know what the... I don't know if it would be worth it. I guess, is my thing. Alright, so this Magmar is gone next turn. Um, unless it retreats. It, it will not. Alright, so I think her deck is the one that has a bunch of random stuff in it. So let's try to get ahead of the curve here and just start removing energies left and right. If we really want to get uh, more energy removal, we have an item finder now. Oops. Well, yeah, just remove the energy from the one Pokemon that has it. We're good. Alright, can I get a Dugong or a Squirtle? No. Nope. I guess I would have taken a Lapras. I want to take another seal, to be honest. Okay, so she's going to keep powering up that Charmander for whatever reason. Alright, Bill, I'll take that. Alright. Energy retrieval's fine, but I really want <laughs> more cards in my hand. And not energies. I think I'm gonna go for it. Show me that uh, that Dugong, so I can 
Uh, just steamroll this team. Come on, I don't need a seal, and I don't need two war turtles, but I do need another bill. All right, fine. I'll I'll take this for now. Although it's probably gonna scratch me, which won't be too pleasant. I mean, at least it's dealing damage, you know. I shouldn't be letting this fight go on this long. It's not good form. Okay, fair enough. This is pretty crazy for a one energy attack. I mean, it can, you know... I mean, it could do zero damage. Like that. But it could do it to 30 damage. Um, at a... Uh, you know, it's not... I don't know. It's not, not too bad of an attack. That's all I'm saying. All right, now let's get rid of this, and let's just start KOing other Pokemon. <laughs> because I can't. Ooh, there's the GB uh, Tangela um, uh, card. Pretty cool art. Looks good. Again, you could just plop that out and put it into like the other Pokemon games, and it would look great. The same goes for any of these. If they use these sprites instead of the ones that they did for the Pokemon games, I mean, like, can you imagine? Game would come even more to life. Of course, then you don't have back sprites, which I, I get that. Back sprites are important for giving you that spatial feel of the, the battleground, you know. I get it. Okay. Get that Lapras out there. Energy removal. From Magnemite. Can't have that. Can't have that. Alright, so I think the, the goal right now is I'll Professor Oak next turn so I can get a Gust of Wind. Um, and I can just Gust around and uh, defeat Pokemon that way. Can I get an F in the chat for this dinner ran? It's trying so hard, but out of nine coin flips, it only has one heads. Complete reversal of the last battle. It's unfortunate, really. Poor unfortunate soul. Alright, we didn't get what I was looking for, but that's fine. I don't... I think we can KO anything it wants to, uh, she wants to put out instead. I mean, Magnemite's not a bad pick, it's just it doesn't have any energy, right? <sighs> okay, now I really want a Gust of Wind. <laughs> gust of Wind, please? Um... Let's see. If that's how you want to do things. Then we can just do this. Wow, Dugong takes three to retreat. Do not retreat, Dugong. You'll completely ruin your flow. But it was necessary, because I want to move on here and fight Nikki. Tell me where Nikki is. Where is she hiding? Well, okay, give me a pack of cards first. See if anything's good here. No.
Not anymore. Ishihara! I should have known. I wonder if he'll trade me cards now. Of course not. I don't stop pushing your books. I am Nikki, the Grass Club Master. What? You're looking for me? Oh my, I'm very sorry to keep you waiting. Doing a little research. I assume you would like to duel. I only duel at the club. I'm sorry. Can you meet me there? Alright, sounds good. Oh my gosh. Don't rub his ego anymore. Alright, fine. Fine, fine. I'll check out his book. Nothing. There's nothing there. I, put, I, I was mashing the A button. Nothing happened. Alright, but now we have... Nikki. I'm the master of the grass club. I'm sorry I kept you waiting. Shall we duel? Yeah. Alright. So, let's see if we can get this duel done in the next uh, nine minutes. Also, Nikki's uh, character sprite. Ah. Oh, sorry about that. Loud noises. Uh, super cute. Oh, I see she is also a master of the no basic Pokemon in hand technique. I also utilize this quite regularly. Alright, looks like we're ready to battle. Alright, a Lapras with, with a healthy amount of water energy in my hand? That's exactly what I want. Well, not really. I want a Squirtle with a Pokemon Breeder and a Blastoise and a bunch of water. That's what I want. And to go first. That's always... That would be the ideal scenario. Well, there's that. Hmm. Intriguing. Yes, I think Nikki is the only trainer in the game to use and execute, so I guess you could call it, like, I guess that's kind of her um, ace Pokemon, if she's the only one that ever uses one. I don't know, I like to try to imagine um, what these Pokemon trainers would look like if they were in, you know, the mainstream games, like what Pokemon would they use. And so Nikki, definitely, definitely an executor type person, but also a Venusaur, you know, or whatever appropriate evolution would be for her gym play. Can I get a Squirtle? None of those were what I wanted. Oh well. I mean, I'll throw Lapras out just to have it out, but... Easy. <laughs> cool. I didn't need it, but I definitely want it. Okay. So now we get to see Bulbasaur here. Bulbasaur is pretty good, I think. Um, it does take two grass energies, but you know, the ability to heal yourself is pretty good. However, again, that 40 HP is going to always, uh, put you in the danger zone of getting a Hitmonchan or, you know, any other number of um, easy 40 damage characters. Nikki also uses the Professor Oak strategy, I see. Leech Seed. Okay. Well, it'll be gone next turn. But, not only will it be gone, but I already have a blast for this. Most excellent. And I can start getting that ready. Okay. Grab another water energy. Good to see. Good to see. Alright, what's this Bulbasaur going to try to do? 
Nothing. Okay. Get Blastoise out there. And check opponent play area. Alright. As much as this, uh, you know, Bul Bulbasaur is funny and all, I'd rather knock out this Oddish because I just cannot handle being paralyzed forever. I need another water energy. Let's knock it out. Alright, easy peasy. Oh, another item finder, so I can just, like, continue this whole Gust of Wind thing over and over and over again. Alright, this is ideal. <laughs> she really wants to use that Oddish, because she knows. She saw her other uh, team members. She knows. She knows how broken it is. We can get rid of those War Turtle and Blastoise. They'll be of no more use to us. That's right. Give her no quarter. We have full control of the board at this point. Oh, come on. Now, Nikki, we went through this last time. You put an Oddish out, you attach a Grass Energy to it, and what do I do? I have to destroy it. I, I'm sorry. I can't let you have energies on things. I'm gonna have to wipe you out. I'm sorry. <laughs> you thought that I wasn't going to have a gust of wind. Ooh. That would be scary if it got out there. Unfortunately, this is gonna be it. Check it out. Easy fight. Not the easiest, but definitely one of the more straightforward fights out there. Just Gust of Wind, Hydro Pump, Gust of Wind, Hydro Pump. Rinse, repeat, rinse, repeat. Thank you, Nikki. What did you leave me? Maybe one day you'll inherit the legendary Pokemon card. Thank you. Alright, that only leaves the Psychic and the Lightning. The Lightning one is going to be challenging for obvious reasons, um, just because we're weak. Um, and the uh, Psychic one is challenging just because it's a hard, it's definitely one of the harder um, masters to fight. Alright folks, well hey, this was uh, our journey into the uh, Grass Club. Next time, we'll take on Imakuni once again after beating a Club Master, and we'll start checking out uh, probably the Psychic Club. I'll see you next time on Pokemon uh, Training Card Game. Thanks for watching. <laughs>